Hey guys, it's Yana. I'm back today with yet another video. And you guys, I am very nervous because I will be going on an airplane with my puppy for the very first time. Kyle and I are going back to Toronto for a little bit and we want to take Arthur with us. So today is the day that Arthur becomes a worldwide traveler and I really want to bring you guys along for the adventure. Okay, so I'm here with my baby Arthur and I really quickly wanted to show you what he's going to be traveling in. I got this really adorable pet carrier from Amazon for like 30 bucks. It's amazing because it opens from both sides and it has a really comfortable bed inside for him to be able to sleep. Although honestly, I doubt that he's going to want to sleep on the plane. To be very honest with you guys, I'm so nervous about Arthur starting to squeal or bark on the plane. I'm really hoping he's a good boy for this. <laughs> Hi, sir. Nice to meet you, sir. Arthur has been super sleepy all morning, which makes me scared that he's gonna enter like zoomy mode very soon. Like he's way too cuddly right now. I want him to be energetic so he can let all his energy out before the plane. But I honestly don't think that's gonna happen. Ready to leave soon? You guys, also because it's so freaking cold in airplanes, I wanted to get Arthur a little sweater so that he can be warm in the airplane. And I just want to show you the sweater because it's literally the most adorable thing I've ever gotten him. This is the freaking sweater. Is it not adorable? It's actually really warm and so cute and it fits him perfectly. It's like a little puppy clothing company here in LA that I absolutely love. They make the best dog clothes and I'm so excited for him to wear it in the plane. Because Arthur is so small, he gets very cold very easy so I want to make sure that he's very snuggly and comfortable in the airplane. I know I get cold in planes so I'm sure he's gonna get cold as well. Like mother like son. since we have arrived to Toronto. Arthur and I made it here safe and sound. Guys, he actually did amazing on the plane. He pretty much slept all throughout the plane unless he was drinking water or having a treat. I flew with Air Canada and he wasn't allowed to like leave his little carrier, but he was supposed to be either in the carrier on my lap or below my feet, which initially during takeoff, he really didn't like because the plane was pretty bumpy. But as everything settled down, he kind of fell asleep and just stopped stopped caring, which I was so relieved about because I was so scared he was gonna be that dog that was just gonna yap the whole plane ride, but he definitely did not. He was an angel. I noticed that he adapts to different environments really fast, which I love about him, because he's gonna need to do that knowing my lifestyle. Today, he also had his first grooming appointment. Where basically, he just got a nail trim and a bath because you're not really supposed to like give Pomeranians haircuts. As you can tell, he just wants to play right now. He does not have an interest in cuddling. I feel like as he's getting older, more of his personality is coming out. Like he's not this sweet little cuddly baby anymore. He's becoming a lot more independent. Like he doesn't really need me as much anymore. And it kind of breaks my heart a little bit, but he's just amazing. Like I love him to death. And I know you guys love him too, because I saw the comments on my last video, everyone saying he's the most adorable puppy in the whole world, which he totally is. Don't at me. Today also Arthur met another dog for the very first time because up until this point, he didn't have all his vaccinations, so he wasn't able to be around dogs. And now that he's fully vaccinated, he can go around other doggies. And I took him to my aunt's house to go play with their golden doodle. And at first, Arthur was very cautious because he is so tiny and the other dog is so, so big.
but they ended up hitting it off and like there was no issue I was worried about Arthur being so small if he would be able to get along with other dogs But he is amazing with other dogs and he's so social with other people Look at that. It smells so good too. Yeah, he just got a bath. He was not a big fan of it. Arthur's part of the team now. Yeah, how do you feel about Arthur, Kyle? Him. How do you feel about him? I think he's a great addition. A great addition? He's Look at him. Wet. Look, he, he definitely doesn't mess with the bath. He does not. He doesn't like it. Oh. Oh. him and just train him and bring him around as many people as many places as many dogs as I can because I really want him to have a full life I want him to have I want to take him everywhere with me I want him to travel the world with me anyway you guys I love you so much I hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and Arthur and I will see you next time bye